Prince Harry's body language in the Netflix docuser is Harry and Meghan indicate that he's still wanted to be loyal to the crown, an expert says. Prince Harry made explosive comments about a heated meeting he had with Prince William, King Charles and the late Queen before he and Meghan Markle quit as working royals, but a body language expert says he appeared torn while explaining the situation. Body language expert Darren Stanton claimed that, Prince Harry is torn between leaving royal duties and remaining loyal to family, as frustrated yet empathetic Meghan fully supports him. Body language expert said, this displayed telling signs he still wanted to remain loyal to the royals in a dramatic scene in his Netflix show. In the final episodes of Harry and Meghan Markle's controversial Netflix docu-series, opens a new tab, which dropped the 15th of December. The couple are seen recalling the events leading up to stepping back as senior working members of the royal family, including a tense discussion between Harry and his family members. Prince Harry recounted a tense meeting he had with the late Queen, his dad's now King Charles and his brother Prince William to discuss the Sussex's exit plan. The Duke of Sussex claimed it was terrifying to have Prince William shout at him, that Prince Charles said things that weren't true and that the Queen sat and remained passive. It became very clear, very quickly that goal was not up for discussion or debate, Harry says. It was terrifying to have my brother scream and shout at me and my father say things that just simply weren't true, and my grandmother quietly sit there and sort of take it all in. And according to body language expert Darren Stanton, it was clear to see signals that Harry was angry but also torn between doing what was best for his royal relatives. Darren continued to analyze, overall, Harry showed a combination of stress and anger in the clip. It's clear he wanted to leave his royal duties, but also wanted to remain loyal to the queen and to his father. He was being pulled into directions and trying to do his best for his family. Bet for Bingo explained, his brows are raised and his eyes widened. Overshowing the eye in this way implies truth and innocence. The thought is that the eyes can't lie so bearing them in this way projects honesty. Speaking on behalf of Bet for Bingo, he said, at one point in the documentary, Harry is seen speaking about a tense meeting with William, Charles and the Queen. Harry flashed an apparent expression of anger. It's clear he still holds a lot of frustration and anger when he thinks back to the situation. He then rubbed his right hand on his knee which is a self-reassurance gesture, before going on to speak about the Queen. According to the expert, Harry shared his frustration and anger over the way the meeting played out and there were subtle shifts in Harry's body language that were revealing. His eyes were immediately drawn down and his posture shifted from an emotion of anger into sadness, Stanton said. I believe he has been deeply affected by the whole situation. The body language expert addressed how Harry seemed conflicted because he wanted to remain loyal. Stanton explained, it's clear he wanted to leave his royal duties but also wanted to remain loyal to the queen and to his father. Stanton added, he also says he is never going to get a genuine apology from them. Prince Harry goes on to fold his arms in a self-protective gesture with Jean saying it also suggests any opportunity for discussion is now firmly closed. It comes as reports suggest Harry and Meghan want an apology from the royals before making a decision on whether to attend the king's coronation next year. They are reportedly demanding a sit-down meeting with senior members of the royal family and are said to want the firm to take responsibility for the pain and damage they put the couple through. According to the Sunday Times, a source close to Prince Harry and Meghan said they're hoping to meet with senior members of the family, as the two feel they have yet to receive any sort of recognition or apology about what they endured. The paper notes that Prince Harry and Meghan are also expected to attend King Charles' coronation in May, where they will be face to face with the family. Thank you for watching our latest video about the royal family. We always try to regularly update the latest news videos about the British royal family to meet your requirements. Our channel always has an objective, multi-dimensional view of the news. My main goal is just to entertain people. Hope you enjoy this news. If you have any questions or requests about content to watch, please leave a comment below this video of us.